A very crucial part to the hydraulic hammer system is the nitrogen pressure. This video will provide directions to check the pressure, adjust the gas, and remedies to common problems. The gas precharge is measured with no preload on the tool. Remove the tool or position the hammer with the tool fully extended. Remove the charge valve cap from the hammer charge valve. Do not remove the charge valve assembly. Turn the NPK charge adapter T handle to a full counterclockwise position. Install it on the hammer charge valve located on the hammer gas head. After tightening the charge adapter cap, turn the T handle clockwise until a resistance is encountered. Continue turning the T handle until the gauge reads pressure. Do not over tighten. Compare the gauge pressure with the nitrogen gas precharge chart that is found in the lid of the charge valve box or the operator's manual. If the gas is 25 psi below the specification, proceed to the nitrogen gas charging procedure. If the gas is 25 psi above the specification, proceed to the nitrogen gas discharging procedure. If the charge is within specification, turn the T-handle counterclockwise until it stops to close the adapter. Slowly loosen the charge adapter cap to relieve the nitrogen gas pressure trapped in the charge valve. After removing the charge adapter from the valve, replace the cap. When adding nitrogen, stay clear of the tool as it may be forced out abruptly. Connect the nitrogen tank to the charge adapter using a pressure regulator and a hose. With the nitrogen tank closed, turn the T-handle on the tank regulator counterclockwise to full closed. Turn the T-handle on the charge adapter clockwise until pressure shows on the gauge. Then, open the nitrogen tank and slowly turn the regulator T-handle clockwise until the correct precharge is seen on the charge adapter. Close all of your valves and release pressure slowly and replace the caps. When preparing to disassemble a hammer or store for long term, it is necessary to discharge the nitrogen system. To do this, remove the charge valve cap from the charge valve found on the hammer gas head. Install the closed charge adapter and tighten the charge adapter cap to the adapter. After installed, turn the T-handle until it reads pressure, then slowly loosen the charge adapter cap until the gauge reads zero. When this happens, remove the adapter assembly and replace charge valve cap. If the hammer loses more than 25 PSI in a 24-hour period, this indicates a gas leak. To locate the leak, spray soapy water to the suggested areas. The gas charge valve, the vent plug located on the side of the hammer main body, and the joint between the gas head and hammer main body. Leakage at any of the above locations will require resealing the hammer. Thank you for tuning into this video about nitrogen charging in hydraulic hammers. Please check out one of our other service instructionals.